Hey guys, we're going to continue working on our Apple ad and I just wanted to show you a quick example of something that I came up with yesterday so that if, if you're looking for something to do because you don't know what else to do for your ad, you can try what I did. And I think this is a great way to end uh, an Apple ad so you could use it as your ending. So um, I'm going to press play here so you can see what it does. and that's all that it does right there. So um, when I click on this slide, you can see in the preview window again that when I click the mouse, it flips all together and then they move out every other bar. And then the apple, um, I made another slide with just the apple and then it just has the uh, zoom or the scale big effect, which is the build out. So if we go back to this slide, you'll notice in my window over here, if I click on the very first one, that is just this purple bar here. I have it on the flip effect and then uh, in order to do that I can click on, I can hold down the shift key and select each one of these bars and once I select all of the bars I can come down here and choose the flip effect and it applies to all of them. And then I'll click in the black space to deselect so um, again what I would like for you to do is to try that. You just uh, draw a square, uh, stretch out the rectangle, duplicate it, change the colors, and then you're going to uh, select all of them, and then you're going to choose the flip effect. And then after you do that, in order to do the, uh, the move out, which is the build out, if I click on this one, you'll see that I chose a move out, and I chose top to bottom. And what I did was I just clicked on the first one, held down the shift key, and clicked on every other one, and did from top to bottom. And then I clicked off, and then I chose the other, uh, the other set of every other one, and then chose from bottom to top. So that's how I did that. And if you need help with that, just let me know.